Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some more Mirror's Edge. Uh, I've decided rather than putting all the bag things at the end of each episode like I've been doing, uh, I'm just going to quickly grab the couple of bags we've missed, and then we can just get on with the story and get everything along the way since I'm checking the guide to make sure we don't miss anything. Uh, so in flight there's just one bag we need and it's right near the end. So we're going to go to the final checkpoint. Uh, we should be able to just head over here and snag it. I think it's under here. Up the rail it's the only yep, there we go. See? There's the little logo. Uh, we gotta jump over this fence. And here it is. So yeah, that took... How long was that? I'm, I'm one minute into the recording, we've already got it. So, that one's done. Uh, the other one we need to do is in jackknife uh let me see i have a little guide up here just to make sure we don't miss anything uh i was the first one in jackknife okay so we want to start level from the beginning actually is it Drake's got a location. Not sure. two out of three i think it's one with the snipers I'm, i think we're in the wrong part <laughs> Uh, I, th I think it's the one in the room with the snipers. I remember looking for a bag there and not finding it. So let's just jump back into... I think it's probably this one? Roughly here. The game doesn't do a super good job on tutorializing you to use the um, run up the wall, hit Q, jump off the wall trick. Um, like there I just used it, it's super duper helpful and really fast, but I was I got stuck here for quite a while because it doesn't really make how obvious how good that move is uh, in the tutorials and stuff. Okay, so we have to get over where the two snipers are, which is on this end. Looks pretty high up. I think we just want to start heading up this way. Up, 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 like so. As long as we keep moving, we shouldn't get killed by them. Because, as I have mentioned before, they are not very good at sniping. They are perhaps not aptly named. We call them snipers, but they perhaps just wish they were as good as a sniper. <laughs> they are a little mediocre when it comes to the act of sniping, I might say. I am also mediocre when it comes to the act of sniping, unfortunately. You can't actually zoom in or anything. It makes this quite difficult. Probably just easy to swing over there and take them out directly rather than trying to snipe them. But yeah, you get the idea. We want to go over there. Unfortunately, there are no checkpoints in this direction because you're supposed to go the other way uh, to do the normal level, so we'll just have to do this part again if we die. Oops. Ugh. I got confused about which move I should have done, I think. Okay, let's try this again. First try wasn't bad, but I think we need to focus less on trying to snipe and more on just going over there and getting them. <laughs> also, I think the origin of the term sniper is quite interesting. If you're familiar with the term snipe hunt, uh, which is like searching for a kind of bird that doesn't exist, 
And so a sniper is someone who's looking for such a bird. Uh, so... And so a sniper rifle would presumably be used to shoot this imaginary bird. Uh, there's just a, a lot of interesting etymology there. Okay, I'm going to do that to get this guy out of my way. Uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah, you can't actually zoom in with the sniper rifle, which makes it... Oh, F! You can zoom in with the sniper rifle, that's easy. There we go, easy peasy. All you gotta do is notice the prompt that tells you how to zoom in with the sniper rifle and you'll have no problems. <laughs> uh. Okay, so you wanna, yeah, you wanna go over here where these guys are, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, see, there's the marker. And bingo! Okay, uh, we are now done with both of the bags we needed to get, and um, we're just going to continue with the game at this point. If we go play chapter, you can see 3, 3, 3, 3, 3. So on we go to chapter 5, New Eden. Hooray! Uh, continue game. Again, I'm checking the guide just to make sure we don't miss anything. Watch it. Mayor Callahan's on some kind of campaign drive about. A few streets away, so there are roadblocks all over the place. I think this one might be one of my favorite levels. I just like the mall structure. It's it's fun to jump around a mall. I like this game a lot overall. Uh why well, I'm playing it, of course, so that we can enjoy it together. Uh, okay. So yeah, we want to get to ground level first, which I've just done. Uh, then we want to start heading towards the mall. Now we don't want to actually be on ground level because that's where all the cops are, so we're going to try to stay a bit higher up most of the time, like we're doing now. Bit of a squeeze there, there we go. There's a low ceiling, so mind your head. Yeah, we want track access, so we're going to keep following these little signs that say track access. There we go. Down track four to the next access stairway. Should be an alley close by there. Get you back on the roof where you belong. I did? No, that's not it. Oh. Oof. Okay, that's not a great start. Um, there goes a rat. Okay, let's give this another shot. Hopefully this time we will not get crushed by a train. I've never actually been crushed by a train, but I imagine that Faith did not just enjoy it just then. Uh, it seems unlikely that it's something she would have enjoyed. I can't really be sure, like, maybe it's super fun. But I've never tried it. So. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we want to go this direction, I think. Yes. Here comes a train. Here comes a train. There goes a train. There goes a train. Okay, there we are. Zip line. Zip line. Okay. <laughs> Oop. And then we want to get in here.
Okay. We're gonna keep moving, keep moving, get in the elevator. Cops are on our way. Goodbye, cops. Okay, we're now on the rooftops again. Okay, so let's continue on toward the mall. Now that we're safely on the rooftops, we shouldn't get accosted by any cops until they figure out we're on the rooftops and then we'll get accosted by a lot of cops. Up the pipe. Blue's moving to the roofs ahead. Looks like you're gonna have a fight on your hands. <gasps> okay, there should be just around here somewhere there should be a package. Perhaps down here? Yes. Bag one. Okay, on we go. Yeah, combat is hard in this game. Where are we? Roughly the same spot. Huh. I went even worse. Try again. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> okay, past these guys. Uh, go that way, get this pipe. Up we go. Time to go into the elevator again. Elevators are fun to climb around in. Or what you mean I guess elevator shafts? Like we're not actually in the elevator. It's down the, it's down the bottom there. Oops. Let's try that again. Ideally with more success this time. There we go. Okay. Uh... 
Up, 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 up. Up some more. Here we go. Okay. You're close to the mall, Faith. Thank you. Looks real bad. Am I supposed to do over here again? Do I just jump over there? Doesn't seem right. Nope, that's what you do. And I got hurt, but I'm over there. That's all that really matters. Because you heal real quick when you get hurt. Especially from like falling or whatever, because you know, being constantly shot out, you just heal almost immediately. <sighs> oh no, more cops! Go away, cops! No one invited you. They're bugged out. You should be able to get into the mall without being shot at. Awesome. I love not being shot at. That's my favorite. Okay, uh, we can see there's another mark there, which means that around here somewhere there is a hiding bag. There? I think it's over here. Over the barbed wire. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> might be more, might be back that way a little bit actually. Uh, hang on. I think it's on top of that piece. Yeah, yeah there it is. Okay. Oh, oh, don't fall. Oh no, I fell. Let's have to do that again. <laughs> and we get into the mall. Easy peasy. Bag two. Uh, we have not missed any so far. Making good progress. Oh, that thing was blocking me from climbing up. Okay, here we go. Bam. Elevator me back. I love the way they bow, bow, bow. That's what my baby says. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, and with that, we are in the mall. Welcome. Of course, the actual doors to the mall don't work. I'll have to get in another way. Thankfully, there is another way. Go in over here. Uh, that should have worked. Hang on. Perfect. A ventilation shaft. Just the perfect way to get into a get into a public place. Yes. Hello. The third and final bag. 
Okay, on we go. At the mall. Rope burn was meant to be meeting his little friend in the atrium, right? Well, it should be just ahead of you. I know it's a dystopia, there's gendered bathrooms. Let's get into this glass elevator, this will definitely protect us from all the bullets. Oh. Accidentally tabbed away from the game. That's why I stopped rendering for a second there. Okay, we're back. Here we go. Time to do some more things. So yeah, uh, we saw, you know, the assassin or whatever, Ropebone's little friend, running away from us, and we have no idea who it is yet. Time to get to the roof. A lot of getting to the roof in this game. Faith likes rooftops. Wall's got some support structures and maintenance areas at the top. There should be a way out up there. Of course. Of course there is. Thanks, Mark. Okay, here we go. Back to the ventilation shafts almost immediately. However, they are, yeah, directly above them all. So, we are in the line of fire. Um, thankfully, Faith recovers very quickly from being shot with a machine gun. Yeah, I don't need to get higher, I'm just trying to remember what I'm supposed to actually do here. I think one of these does the trick, yeah. yeah. You use that move all the time in this game. And they only mention it, like, as a one-off thing, and they talk about wall running, but you don't have to wall run, you just, like, walk into a wall, essentially, and you can do it. Yeah, we hit that to make this fan stop spinning so we can go down here, basically. Down we go. Yeah, they have a machine gun. Or, as uh, Merc puts it, a goddamn machine gun. We do not want to be in the line of fire with that thing for more than we have to be. Ah, I missed. Oof. Okay. Yeah, this is not a stealth game. This is a just charge past everyone kind of game. <laughs> okay, let me just break some of this glass. Okay, there we go. Let's go! Thank goodness this glass is bulletproof for some reason.
should be one last door and you're out of there. Where's the door? Looks like my little friend is back. Think he's the assassin? I don't know, but I think I know someone who does. It's Jackknife. Remember that guy? Hey, Faithy. Nice of you to drop by. With a little bit of persuasion, Wilburn was pretty chatty. Told me about his meeting with Pope's killer at the mall. And you're thanking me, right? But when I got there, guess who was waiting for me? No idea, Faithy. I just go there for the pretzels. Bad case of the blues. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? No, Faithy! It wasn't me! <laughs> Besides, if I wanted you dead, don't you think I would have just killed you myself? You're right. A creep like you couldn't have organized- Now, don't be like that. Ropeburn's dead. I'm impressed. It wasn't me. You need to be careful who you hang around with. Oh, I learned that a long time ago. And yet, here we are again. But I'm afraid I'm gonna have to cut this little meeting short, Faithy. Places to be, you know how it is. Try not to get yourself killed. Merc, Merc, you can stop pretending not to listen now. <laughs> What's up? Can you do a search on Perundello Kruger security? On it. Why do you ask? Been seeing their name around. In Ropeburn's office and somewhere else. Distinctive logo. Getting anything? Just what you'd expect. Alarms, fencing, armored cars, private security. Oh, and they secure our world, apparently. Where are they based? A few offices around town. Just got a new place down near the docks. Get me some coordinates. I'm gonna go check it out. Toward the building with the big stupid dog symbol. Loading bay should be a way in. And that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, we check out Pirandello Kruger. <laughs> and stop. Bye.